the bathroom and the laundry rooms as well we brought it all the way out to the gate by the corner of the building with the hope that one day if they do have a gutter in front of the house then we can connect it although we are an overflow pipe that will be attached to it that will be connected into the drainage system or into the gutter so what you should also do in this situation is to give it an access by putting a clean out on the soak away so that you can always have access to it the worst case scenario and it's not working effectively you can have a small pump and have it pumped out you give it a clean out and that's what we decide to do now for all the projects i mean if you have realized over the years we insist on having a clean out on each digester and so can we that we do it makes it easier for future use if the whole place is covered at least you know that there's something that you can always have access to if you are considering constructing a biodigester for your dream house there are a few key tips you have to consider you can consider a large size digester plus a traditional soak away just for the whole burden or you can decide to have them in smaller units depending on how far apart they are from each other so if you have a burden and the washrooms on one side and there's washrooms on the other side what it means is that you might have to consider doing them two separate digesters because you really do not want pipes running around the house hoping to get into a biodigester and then the problem will become that the biodigester's depth is not that much so it means that you need to have a, enough gradient for the digester to come and hit the base in terms of the inlet where you have the biodegradable material working from so in that situation what you do need is to have them separated have separate digesters done for each part of the burden on the other side if you have a slope and it's going to one side and that's where the digester is going to be placed then the better for you one large digester will work in that situation you have it done and then you attach the traditional soak away to it you get it uh -huh. so that's what should be done the traditional soak away is what changes the whole mindset for the wastewater management in your compound so even in this particular digesters we even had to consider that same mindset but it was done with the mindset that the soil is good so we are going to just construct a small size traditional soak away for it and then knowing that the number of users in the facility is not that much right and then the toilets are being divided two toilets are taking one digester then obviously it's going to be less usage or less pressure on one particular digester at any given point in time the bio digesters we are using the prefabricated slabs the space that we need we prefer the prefabricated slabs have them erected nicely 